starting the vlog for my, um, I'm in the car. I, I am going to visit, uh, I'm just going down the back road here. And then when I get on the highway, of course, I will stop filming. I am going to visit my daughter-in-law who has a vegetable and fruit stand. I will leave her link. She has a page on Facebook and I will leave her link on the screen and in the description box below. So I just figured I would talk to you a little bit on my way up there until we get to the highway up here, Route 3. So, oh gosh, I'm a little overwhelmed, guys, with I just started moving everything and, and clearing out a big path for that desk. I, I do have the, uh, the Alex slash Ikea drawers in the uh, studio already and it's kind of piled high right now with dividers and just various things but yes I am very very overwhelmed right now of course I will be overwhelmed until I get to a point where you know I think once I get a lot of stuff in those drawers then after that then I will uh, become a little less overwhelmed but I am oh gosh I am having fun with it even though I'm overwhelmed but it, it's a huge job that room is not very big I, I'm really surprised at how I packed all the stuff that I have in that room it's it's small um, it has a full bed in there what I would really like to do is get a day bed in there. So I will have a little more room, of course. <coughs> Plus I have a doctor's appointment at three o'clock today. So yeah, my cough has gotten worse. It's a little, uh, it's more deeper in my chest a little bit and I've got phlegm with it now, so. Anyway, yes, I've got a doctor's appointment and then hopefully this evening after I get back home and rest just a little bit, I will get back with it a little bit in my studio doing a bit more cleaning. So I hope y'all are having a great day. By the way, I do have new glasses on. I picked those up, I think it was day before yesterday. So anyway, I think that's it with my little ramble here. I will catch up with y'all soon. Hi y'all. Um, the furniture is mainly where I want it. You know, I could always, I can always move it around again, but this is basically what we're looking at. There's the drawers. Um, I went ahead and put on a long uh, gray scarf on though because I thought it really looked uh, nice. I may get something lacy or something to put on there. I don't know. But the only thing so far, the only thing that's going to be sitting on top of those drawers is that pretty lamp in the middle. I really love that lamp. It's a blue domed lamp. And this is where I'm going to be filming right here. And I have so much storage on this a little desk here I can uh, put things down there and I've got this uh, I've had this this uh, shelf here for a little while and I can uh, put things all the things that I need around me to film so anyway my next step is to fill these drawers I think that's gonna be my next step but to look I got a lot of work to do look <laughs> got all that um, I had 
two of these, I have two of those shelves. Those two I'm getting rid of. I think I'm just going to put a round table right there and put a, a vase of flowers or something. And I have these, let me turn on a light. I have these fabric drawers. Um, they're actually for ch a child's room. I was gonna put those in my closet, but I changed my mind. Um, they are going to go in that area right right there and then i have a little round table it's going to go there so in this black shelf here you've seen it many times it was behind me when i was doing my videos that's going in my bedroom so and i i have a lot of those um square totes there so some can go down there and so i think i'm going to have enough storage and this doesn't look like it right now but i have a lot more room in my studio and i'm going to move things around on the walls so I'm not sure i'm not even thinking about the walls right now i just want to get <laughs> that bed unloaded and all my makeup stored in the drawers so anyway that's where we're at right now i'll see you in a bit okay y'all another day monday morning um i've decided to keep this black shelf in the room and i'm getting rid of this shelf and the other one i have two shelves like this and i'm getting rid of these both of these and I will be putting this shelf in its place. So, so uh, I'm slowly getting there. This is what I have on top of the drawers. Mm, might be a little cluttered. We'll see. I don't know. But anyway, yep, it's uh, the desk is all done and up my husband worked tirelessly on putting these drawers together and putting my desk together and everything i've dropped so many things um but yes i'm very busy but i'm sort of like sort of over the over overwhelm so anyway i will catch up with you guys later Hey there, Tuesday morning in my pajamas. <laughs> I am lining the rest of my drawers. And later on in the vlog, I will show you what all is in the drawers. Lining the rest of them and putting, I, I'm, I'm down to my shadow palettes. So yeah, having fun here. And there's my Winnie. Hi, baby. He wants to get on the contact paper. <laughs> Hi, baby. So, here I am. I am just, I've got pretty much everything set up for my filming. And I am just testing out some lighting. Testing out angles, lighting, um... All that kind of stuff. So you guys let me know what you think. I, um, I've i got some totes, the square totes that I need to clean out. I've got still, I've, I still have stuff on the bed. And I'm pretty happy with this setup here. I uh, feel more, I don't know, I think I'm going to feel more creative. So anyway, um... So I'm almost there guys and uh, I will let you see what's in my drawers and everything. I still have this this shelf here. I got to clean all that. I got to clean that out too and uh, you know make everything feasible more feasible around me so that I can be I can reach everything that I need to get. So anyway I will see you in a bit.
Okay, y'all. Um, the project is pretty much finished. Um, I'm going to shut the door so I can... But just showing you different, you know, things. And I have um, those mini, mini drawers here positioned um, at an angle. That's for my backdrop or background when I do my videos. And this is how I've got my desk set up for filming. Don't pay attention to the walls. Um, it's not how, the only thing I didn't do is the walls. So anyway, this is uh, how I've got my filming area set up. I've got some totes down there to go through. So that's really the only thing I gotta do. And this is um, <laughs> my setup to uh, film my videos. It's just for right now, I gotta figure out something else. I mean, it's pretty sturdy, but it, it doesn't look pleasing to me. So I'm gonna figure out something else, but that's my ring light. I do film with this middle one on too at times and my mirror and these two acrylic containers and this one here, all three of them, is uh, I'm going to be each month starting next month, July, I am going to be uh, filling those with the makeup of the month so and also I have <laughs> a load of lipsticks I do not have a um, Alex slash Ikea drawer for the lips so that's where most of them went and I have a lot right there as well and uh, this is just a look at some of the things that I'm going to be reviewing very soon. I also got a eyeshadow palette, a Profusion eyeshadow palette that Emily Noel, YouTube, but she used it and inspired me to purchase that. And that was only $25 at Walmart. And that is, um, a lamp and pictures of my uh, two cousins, sister-in-law and my sister and myself. Um, and this is a picture of my sister and myself. And um, I have these drawers up here on top of this shelf here. And that is my filming area. So I do have down here more things that I that I want to um, do videos on. So I have them lined up and I've got plenty of filming content ideas. So, and I'm gonna show you what is in my drawers. First one here, primers. I do need to do a, a um, I do need to do a declutter of these uh, primers for sure. Um, these are my, um, concealers. I need to do a declutter on my concealers as well. Um, uh, foundations. These are my foundations. I just did a declutter on the foundations not too long ago. And this is my, um, BB cream, sunscreens in tinted moisturizers and this is my face palettes uh, most of them are high-end and down here is morphe eyeshadow palettes i have all my eyeshadow palettes toward the bottom of uh, these three drawers and then this last one is just odds and ends 
eyeshadow odds and ends and, and singles and whatnot. And then the top of my second drawer is powders. Um, this uh, whole column here is high end and the rest all are drugstore. Now I'm going to get it, get in the habit of putting um, the ones that I've hit pan on in the front so that uh, so that I use them. And then my next drawer is um, setting powders. This is uh, all the high end here, and um, let's see what are these. Yeah, this and this, this and this, and all this is high end. And these are a few more setting powders, bronzers, and I have a few highlights in there as well. I don't really have a lot of bronzers or highlighters, but anyway, I like to use my face palettes for the uh, highlighters. Um, this is my um, blushes. Um, this whole column here is the high-end ones. And this here is, um, I have NYX eyeshadow palettes in here. And NYX and uh, Milani, Revlon. Uh, just just a mix Maybelline and uh, that's that and then this is LA girl elf and that is L'Oreal I love that palette and then uh, cuts up two covergirl palettes that I really love and these are um, my uh, Profusion eyeshadow palettes. I have two big ones. And the top of the third drawer is mascaras. Let's see, these, uh, these are all high-end right here and right here. And then the rest are drugstore. We have quite a few new um, mascaras to try out. And all my um, eyelash curlers. And the next drawer are my eyelashes. And uh, the next one is uh, brows and eyeliners. Next one is all my Too Faced eyeshadow palettes. Yeah, I have a lot. <laughs> but anyway, pull them all so they'll be nice and neat. I love Too Faced. My favorite, as you guys know. And, um, uh, Urban, Urban Decay, um, NARS, I have a Narvina palette, and my Charlotte Tilbury. I have two small ones and, uh, these two big ones. And, okay, um, um, uh, ColourPop, 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 BH, um, Kathleen Lights, Fenty Beauty, Pacifica, uh, Queen, El Queen Eloise, um, Pacifica, and that's that. One more drawer, and this is all my, um, Makeup Revolution. I have quite a few big palettes here. This is the Tammy X Revolution. I have this one. 
Then I have, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna get this out and leave it out to uh, do some eye looks with that. I need, I haven't used that, this palette that much and I love it. The Makeup Revolution, the Emily Edit, the Once. And the one that I am missing right now is the Jeffree Star um, Artistry Eyeshadow Palette. It's probably in one of those uh, totes back there. But anyway, those are my drawers. <laughs> I think I got them pretty well organized. Who knows, I may um, move things around a little bit, but that is my project. And I really, really love how it turned out, especially my um, filming area. Yes, it is a little cluttered. I may move things around a little bit and different things. But anyway, I... Uh, We'll see you in a little bit with makeup on and just talk about a few things that I'm going to be reviewing very soon. In a little bit. Catch you guys later. Hi ladies. Welcome back to my channel. I have everything in place with my new furniture, my new desk here, and my new uh, drawers back there. So... <laughs> My Winnie's over there on the bed. He's just sleeping away, but he looks so darn cute. I hope you ladies are having a great day. If you're new here, my name is Tammy Ambrook. I do all kinds of beauty reviews, makeup reviews, get ready with me's. I talk about skincare, weight loss, fashion, jewelry, and hair, all those things. If you like all those things, stick around and subscribe to my channel. I just want to uh, discuss what all I put on my face today. I have lots of shine, lots of uh, shimmer, sparkle, and glow. I'll tell you what I put on my face. First of all, the eyeshadow that I used is um, KAB Cosmetics and eyeshadow palette and that is the colors that i used and i re really laid it on thick with this shimmer here so i really like the way my eyes turned out and then finally got my hands on the dior backstage glow face palette those are the shades, and I love, let me tell you, I love this blush, okay? And it's got uh, shimmer in it, and I didn't use these two, but I used that uh, up here on my brow bone, and here on my uh, cupid's bow, my nose here, and on my cheeks over my blush. I use this KAB Cosmetics Glow Illuminating Dusk. And that is what is really shining on my uh, cheeks there. I don't usually go in with that much uh, glow, shimmer, whatever, on my cheeks. But I thought today um, it called for that application so uh, anyway um, yeah I'm really liking the cab um, cosmetics I want to check into more of their cosmetics and I also love the um, KAB oil and what is the name of that I've used it before on my channel it is juicy melon that is called a Juicy Melon. Hope you can see that. So I really liked the way my uh, makeup turned out today. Um, let me know if this is too much glow, sparkle, shimmer for my age.
just let me know in the comment. You're not going to hurt my feelings. Just let me know what you think. So uh, anyway, I guess I love that palette there. Love it. Okay, a couple of things that I'm going to be reviewing very soon is the NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation. And also I have NARS Blush Palette. Let's see what exactly that is called. The NARS Basic Instincts Cheek Palette. The shades in this palette, now I don't know why they have to call these uh, these shades these names, but um, one of them is Orgasm, one of them is Behave, Orgasm X, and Dulce Vita. So let me share with you the shades in that palette. That's the front of it. I have used it a little bit. I do want to give it a proper review along with the, um, the foundation. Also, I've been talking about this Peter Thomas Roth um, Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream Hydrating Moisturizer. I really, I'm really loving this. Um, I have, I've, don't have a whole lot left, but I think I've been using this close to three months. I really like it. And plus, I have both of these. Um, I have not used the face firm. It is called Peter Thomas Roth um, Clinical Skin Care Instant Firm Face Tightener. Both of these are temporary. And I have tried the uh, Peter Thomas Roth Instant um, Eye Firm Eye Tightener temporarily. And um, I'm going to be applying these in a video soon and giving them a proper review. It does really work under your eyes. But, well, I'll share all that when I do the review. So I wanted to... Um, share with you an eyeshadow palette. I don't know if any of you follow um, Emily Noel YouTube, but she used this palette. It is um, Pro Profusion Cosmetics, and you get this at Walmart, and it was $25, and she did a review on um, this palette. And she really inspired me to get this palette. So I am going to let you see the shades. It still has the plastic on it, but you can see the shades of the eyeshadow palette. These are correctors right here. Um, these are liners. And I think you add water to these liners. Yes, it does say, I don't know if you can see it, but it does say add water to these liners. And the next, this is all face sculpting right here. These two rows there. And then the blushes on the bottom. I think I'm going to like it. It has a lot of um, purples and violets and everything in there. So, um... Anyway, I just wanted to share with you a few things that I'm going to be reviewing very soon. And I wanted to share with uh, the makeup that I used today. I hope you enjoyed the vlog of revamping, reorganizing my um, makeup studio. I enjoyed it. It was a big undertaking. At first, I was very like you've seen in my um, my footage, that I was really, really overwhelmed at first when I first started getting into all everything that I had. I did pitch a, a lot of junk. I will be doing more declutter. So if you liked my vlog, give me some thumbs up. And if you like my channel, 
and you haven't done so yet, subscribe and always hit that little bell so you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. So what do you think of my hair and all the gray? I still need to get a haircut. It is so long, it's hard to do anything with it. Maybe this week I will be getting a haircut. I love you guys. Expect lots of reviews, ready with me's, and I'm also doing another giveaway in the fall. So I will see you in the next video. I love you all. Bye-bye.